What would happen if you placed a live goldfish inside a blender and then just placed it in front of random people? Well, believe it or not, that's exactly the question that this man investigated, and what he found was really disturbing. His name is Marco Iveristi, and he's an artist from Denmark. In 2000, he created a piece that he called Helena, which was basically just a room with 10 blenders in it, each containing a single live goldfish. The concept was simple. Visitors would be given a choice to either press a large on button and kill the fish for absolutely no reason, or to not touch the button and let the fish live. Marco intended for his art piece to be a social experiment to force people to do battle with their conscience. And although at first visitors were obviously hesitant to turn on a blender, eventually at least one person actually did, taking the lives of two goldfish. Almost immediately after, people began protesting that Marco's art piece was far too horrific and cruel. Local police soon agreed and demanded that the exhibit be taken down. When Marco refused, however, they issued him a $200 fine for animal cruelty. But when he refused to pay and protested in court in the name of artistic freedom, some vets testified that since the goldfish would have died almost instantly, they were not exposed to prolonged suffering and Marco managed to escape from any punishment.